dispose of this annoyance at once. I just let a really weird one rip as I was sitting down. Hey, everybody. <laughs> Welcome back to the play for you for Borderlands 2. I'm dead. I'm over here. Yeah, so, on the way to Sanctuary. But first, we got to fucking catch a lift. Uh, now we get to see the inspiration for one of uh, Dead Man's recent D&D &D villains. Wait, who? What? Catch a ride! Oh, yeah, he, he wasn't the fuck. wasn't inspiration. He was just... That was, was just a, a happy coincidence. It was a joke, Dead Man. I love this gun! I love this gun! Oh my god, this is the best thing. I Oh my god. I didn't even bother summoning Death Trap. I feel like this game is eventually going to turn into us just like trying to grab shit and then give, our, give each other our hand-me-downs. Uh, no. That's what it's been for me so far. Just, I get a new thing. Hey, is your thing worse than the? Th hey, is my is my thing I just got rid of worse than the thing you? Better they're worse than the thing you have. I like it tends to get pretty forgettable. At, like the oh, this is a thing that we can do because, like, oh, I become hyper specialized for this thing. I become hyper specialized for this thing. It's just, eh, I I don't think we're going to end up in with the issue this is of. A First, we're gonna buy and sell shit. Yep. Welcome to my humble shop. Marcus just asked me if I was feeling overburned by money. No, no, I'm not. I want to be able to retire. I want to be able to retire to a comfortable family home on Pandora. I'm not fucking deluded enough to believe I could retire. Oh, you're completely insane, whereas I am somewhat mentally stable. I just got a new shield, so now I'm at 185. I'm at 183. You stop looking at me! It is so weird playing this with headphones on because it's just like I can tell based on the direction where the bullets are. Oh yeah, you, you don't play with headphones normally. That's that is so weird. Normally, it's been so long since I've not played with headphones that I can't even fathom what that's like anymore. God dang it. I got you, partner. Give me your fucker. Big chest. <laughs> Woo, murder. All right, I don't need any of those shields. I don't think you need any of them either, but I figure I'll take a look in case. Because it could be a let. Oh, it's the shield, but it's like. Bullshit. It's like bullshit. Yep, that's what I figured. Well, hey, I made like twenty bucks. Yeehaw! Get your ass! I slept with my sister. <laughs> it is so weird to think that those two came out of Mad Moxie. <laughs> <laughs> Eh, it takes all kinds. Also, have you ever seen Mad Moxie without the makeup? It's probably just nightmares. Nope, and I never want to. Somebody's drawn it. And they probably made her smoking hot because they probably drew it for porn. No, you'd be surprised how many people draw ugly people for porn. I don't want to think about that. A guy in my in-person D and D group apparently gets paid to draw furries, like in like lizards with really big tail dicks. Okay. Yeah, it's the guy. It's the guy I told you about. Ah, say no more. Oh, that's nice. Nothing 
Oh, when you do the catch a ride, I want to design one of the vehicles because I have a bunch of skins lo unlocked and well, I, I like using the skins I unlock. Okay, uh, just question: Does a capacity of one eighty nine, a recharge rate of fifteen, or a recharge delay of four point six, four point seven six, sound interesting to you at all? Uh, no. Okay. I mean, it's a decent. It's it raised my shield by total, like fifteen points because they have a percent increase on shields, but. I'm now at 227. Yeehaw! Let, 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 I, want, I want to design the, the vehicle. Ooh, Piment Taco! You can have fun doing that. I drive. No, oh, that's fine. I hate driving these things. What are we thinking? Um, the pink, po the pink pony. What are you feeling like? Oh, that that's too cool to pass up. Uh, yeah. I can shoot you geez. right now. It'd be so easy. Isn't that a cool color? Big. Oh, the design on it. Okay. Yeah. Like, when we thought color, I was like, what? Oh, it looks gunmetal. It's it's a purpley blue. It's purple with blue. Uh... Woo! Yeah, you're the greatest driver alive, dead man. Never said I was a good greatest... driver. You're the greatest driver alive. Good lord, why am I letting Creek drive? He's probably hallucinating where the road is. Yeah, I also, is just, with me? I also just lost my license. IRL? Yeah. Why am I letting you drive? Yeah, like, uh, the, the thing, the reason I lost my license was because I hadn't driven on a highway enough to be able to get the next grade of license. How do they keep track of that? Uh, you come in and tell them. Oh. So you were honest? Yeah, I'm Canadian. <laughs> no Plus, also, like, the thing is, like, like, I will never, I will probably never be able to afford a car. Fair enough. So I could keep paying money to get a license that I will be able to use for the next couple months while I live here. Or just say fuck it and get around in, like, fucking rideshare when I eventually leave this fucking bullshit city. Your liver is a hood ornament! Me, I'm good drive man. Yeah, you've got 10 points so far. I've made a 75 point turn. <laughs> it also like doesn't help how, how, because the driving of this is so goddamn fucking weird. Yeah. Like the fucking, it, it's the halo driving. Oh, I have a gun, right. Yeah, you have a gun. I forgot I had a gun on this car. Why are we going this way? Uh, well, uh, for a second, Dad needs to check out what guns are available. Guns, guns, guns. Hmm, anything good? Uh... Might as well use infinite bullets to get some experience. Oh, wait, yeah, just do this. I will peg one of these racks eventually. Ew. There's no bullet drop in this game. Don't talk about pegging the bracks. <laughs> Is that nothing good? Are you oh, serious? Well. I all that time, I couldn't hit one rack. Yeah, that sounds about right. I think he's... Holy shit, he's alive. Well. Uh, 
Let's see what good shit they got over here. Banzai! You know one thing I've never done? What's that? I've never explored the crater after, um... Are we, are we gonna, are we reserving spoilers or do we not care given how old this game is? Uh, given how old the game is, who fucking cares? Okay, I've never explored the crater under Sanctuary. Like, I've heard you can get, like, Minecraft heads and shit in there. Oh, well then we're never exploring it. <laughs> Fuck that 8th grader shit. Not? This is a psycho! I'm a fancy psycho, thank you very much. Uh, You're a psycho! I've been hearing all this radio chatter about. My name is Roland. I used to be a vault hunter like you. Until I and you had the best skills, because you could summon a second soldier who would give me infinite health and ammo. I'm trying to shoot behind, but it just goes up. I can't shoot you either. I'm trying to shoot you, I'm trying to shoot behind. He contracted us, so he's an STD? Yeah. No, I think we're his STD. Okay. Yeah, if he contracted us, then we're, yeah, we're the STD. We're the STD, yeah. Which makes sense. You know, meat is fire. Wait, why'd I get out? I have a gun in the car. You know, I recently invented an entire plane of madness that is just, like, organically grown human bits. Huh. Like, there were blood fields, marrow fields, all that kind of shit. Oh, sounds neat. Kind of sounds like kind of sounds like the dream I described to you guys. A little bit, yeah. Just like, just like the landscape of your dream turned to fire and meat. We play D and D together. <laughs> yeah, it'd be really fun when I got to build out a new arch fiend. Uh, not looking forward to killing that guy. They'll be almost a god. I'm stuck. <laughs> I keep getting stuck on things. <laughs> We're fucking coming. You can survive a few minutes. Oh, I got next to a stinging cactus. That's explained why I'm taking damage. <laughs> like, seriously, I teleported. I, I, I had a little bit of a lag hiccup. Man, there's all kinds of weird fucking yeah. frame rate hiccups in this thing. <laughs> I killed all three of them with a grenade. Wasn't me. Yeah, you were with me. You have an alibi. Well, you never know. They could just think I'm threatening you to give me an alibi. Uh, I wouldn't fall for that. I'm pretty sure Death Trap could take you. Yeah, but the cops don't know that. No, I'm dead. You're dead? Hi. Oh. I can't believe I fell for that. <laughs> oh, I'm so mad about that right now. Nice shot. Word. Yeah, I need to look up what the fuck's up with the frame rate that I, the frame rate hiccups I'm getting. Mm. Like, yeah, I'm running things on max, but I got a fucking decent system. Yeah, and this is an older game. Yeah. Ah. 
Oh well. It's time to start saving up money for the 3,000 I need to upgrade. Hmm, we have to kill 20 blood. Do you think... Do you think we can... Do you think we can handle 20? Oh, I don't know about that. I think we can handle 20. I'm not... I'm not I don't so know. It sounds like a yo -yo. I decided to give them a chance by switching to my other gun. The one that shoots explosions. Open your veins. That's the power core. Great. Jack will destroy sanctuary today. I'll get back to the city. We'll meet up once I get there. Do we have to? I mean, we're kind of busy. Want Jack to destroy your city. I'm always a little, a little galled when a game like say fallout says that you actually have the freedom to choose but you don't really yeah that's a lot of games it's just one of the reasons i fell off like telltale stuff like like yeah i dig like, yeah i dug life is strange and i'm gonna be i'm gonna be fucking getting life is strange too but it's like you get to that ending and it's just like hey yeah all your decisions they didn't fucking matter you get one decision, and that's what matters. And when you choose the and when you choose the decision that you think wouldn't be the right one, then the actual like bad outcome isn't that bad. So like I played that game on this channel, uh, beginning to end. I'm gonna be doing the same thing with Life is Strange too. But uh, the thing that was weird to me was I chose the sacrifice Arcadia Bay ending. The right ending. Yeah. But you get to the ending, and before there's been any cleanup, before there's been any kind of, like, rescue efforts, the second that tornado ends, Chloe and Max are able to drive in a straight line out of Main Street. Which, given the stuff I've seen about much lesser tornadoes, leads me to believe that that tornado, the second it hit land, it dissipated. Yep. Just, it made landfall and then just go, went away. A bunch of bullshit and yeah, a bunch of bullshit. Both yours. Those are both yours. Yeah, they were both a bunch of bullshit. Yeah, did you ever did you ever uh, see the there was there was a there was a web comic that was released, not by the folks at fucking uh, Don't Nod or Square or anything, but it was like a hey here's what happened after the storm. Seriously? Yeah. Yeah, it was essentially like hey here is. Here is a fan idea of what happened after the events of the Sacrifice Arcadia Bay ending. Okay, that's a weird one. And, yeah, it essentially, like, delved more into, like, hey, Max and Chloe coming out as a couple. Everyone's dead. It doesn't matter. No, no one died. What? Yeah, you go and meet, yeah, in the in that comic, you go and meet both, uh, both of Chloe's parents. So Joyce and David still lived. And then Max's parents show up. No, the right decision kills all of those assholes. That's why it's the right decision. Yeah, then you like you get to the fucking end. Like the comic stopped because either like their life got in the way or they got like a fucking cease and desist or something. But they stopped making the comic. But the idea of it was that they would like the two of them were like, "Yeah, so we fucking now. It's great. Love you. Love you, bro." And they and then they uh, move to, I think, either L.A. or Portland. You know those two very interchangeable cities? I'm still listening. Yeah, so they either, yeah, they move, to either L yes, so they move to either L.A. or Portland. Um, Max is having PTSD dreams. I'm like, oh, oh god, I killed all those people. And then, and then Chloe's like, yo, bro... You hella didn't kill nobody, Brahim. Oh, Lord. And then, like, they take a fucking Polaroid picture, and then they drop it, and for a second it flashes, and there is an evil fucking punk rock death metal version of Max. Okay. Because apparently her changing the timeline and killing all those people resulted in a fucking hot topic version of herself. From 
from there, th- from there, things kind of fell apart. As it was more just like, as it was more just like fucking um, like journal entries that, like, to be fair, were written as well as the characters were in the game. Hmm. Which isn't saying much because the writing in that game is not the strong suit of the game. Like, do you hella get me, bro? Please stop talking. Word. <laughs> It's like the fucking Scooby Doo movie. But anyway, uh. Yeah, I got one! <laughs> but anyway, so yeah, uh, they. They go through all that, uh, they get, get a bunch of journal entries of like, hey, like, hey, I'm fucking sad and shit. And then Chloe steals the journal and writes in, yo, stop being sad, bitch. And. You get to the, you get to like the very end of it. And the final couple chapters are uh, Max has a dream where Chloe fucks Rachel while Rachel's wearing the hot dog man outfit. And then they just fucking stop. It was a weird goddamn... It was a fucking weird-ass goddamn book. Well, not book, just fucking web series. That I can't splinch. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't know why it stopped, and I don't know why they went down that route. Like, who, what fucking drugs were they on where they were sitting there thinking, hey, you know what this story about time travel needs? Evil punk rock duplicates. Oh, and I have decided that I will tell you my secret later on. Once you've earned it. Is the secret that you're actually a woman? Is a secret that you that you just wear that face because it makes you feel prettier? Is the secret that you're in love with Dead Man? <laughs> eh, no one's in love with me. Oh. Did you just shoot yourself? I was trying to shoot the bottle and I forgot what gun I had. <laughs> I was right next to you. <laughs> oh, don't judge me. Uh, so, do you want the rifle that he's given away? Blitz, look alive, oh, everybody. sure. I'll take a rifle. Uh, well, so it's a 42 damage, 91.2 accuracy, 16.7 fire rate, 4.2 oh, reload. Well, I can also pick up a rifle from him, so, uh, like, mine's not very good, but, uh. Like, my current uh, rifle uses two shot per uh, bullet, but its only cool thing is it fires as fast as you can pull the trigger. Seriously, that is not a cool effect. Yeah, th- this one has that too, but it doesn't have the fires two shots. Uh, it's a, you said it deal 44? 42. 42? Uh, that is incrementally better. Good. That ought to last us a day. Okay, then. Uh, the shotgun that he was offering was a bunch of shit that didn't offer me anything. Same. Yeah, the slight decrease in damage. Well, it's not a slight decrease, but it means I won't waste all my ammunition. And I have nothing better. So rolling out. Why aren't you transforming? Let me get the gate for you. <laughs> no, 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 friends, friends, to friends. Commander Roland never came. No, 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 friends. <laughs> oh man. Wait, did you try to descend? Did you try to like de-escalate yourself by? Going from crap to darn? Yes, she did. Aw, oh, heck. Aw, oh, bumber shoots. Which is actually a swear I say. This, I do, this really I fiddles do, my cheese sticks. I do shout bumber shoots <laughs> because I find it hilarious. Uh. This is a recorded message to any Crimson Raiders in the area. Just taking Since every mission I can find. Four Hyperion spies masquerading as bandits. I'm I'm letting you do that so that they can see the quest like thingies. Hello, <laughs> Bully 
goes to print. Search some bullymong bone piles, will you? I'll learn something about their diets and come up with a catchier name for the beasts. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Ah, oh, I love Marcus. This gun doesn't seem to work. Mm. I don't know. Test it. <laughs> Looks like it works to me. But it's supposed to proc lightning damage. <laughs> hey, I got Hey, Vault Hunter. If you're gonna be a part of the Crimson Raiders, hey, uh, how to use the elemental weapons, yes, I found something that you might want. Oh, you should come over to me. You like pistols, right? <laughs> yes. Wanna help me test them out? I'll see you in the firing range. Let's try out the fire weapon. Present to make up for the fact that I picked up an awesome one. Okay, so the weapon damage, fire rate, and accuracy are all lower. Are you serious? Well, let's see how this does. Oh, fire damage. Yeah. Uh, this feels like cheating. It's part of the game, and I, I do limit myself to, like, I don't use all my keys all in one go. Are you not going to take the grenade? Nah, even this pistol kind of feels like too much. Alright, it's up to you. Free choice. It is like getting something that requires you to sign up for a secondary service. Oh, I no, I didn't sign up for anything. I don't do that. I hate doing that. I have, I have quit games because they tried to make me do that. No, this is part of the game. Like... I do, you do have to like pay attention to their Twitter feed to get the codes, but this is like intentionally part of the game. Good luck. So like, do you want a two twenty five shield? Ah, uh, hell yes! That sounds awesome. Okay, just let me swap out the two twenty five shield with my new two forty five shield. Because that's much better. That's a much better shield. And then drop it right there. Oh, and also we got a... We got a weapon from for a fucking mission. But let's worry about that later. For now, let's finish up the missions that we actually had when we came into town. Which I'll go do while you are shopping. No, no, I don't, like... I don't have to do anything. Ta -da. I got an assault rifle. I've got a, uh... I wonder if they call this an assault rifle. I call it just a rifle. It's not a sniper rifle, but it doesn't have the... What the fu... A building appeared in front of me. <laughs> oh, crap. Did you hop here? I heard all of you were robots, and you eat metal out the garbage and stuff. Knew That's racist. Come for me, what's rolling went missing. Now, if you're here to kill me, you should probably know. You'll never take me alive, you robotic stone bitch! Hey, he's a robot. I'm not. I'm just psychotic. Wait a minute. <laughs> well, hang me upside down from a telephone pole, cover me in honey, and leave me to a slow death the hands of us sputtering. <laughs> you ain't no Hyperion robot. Oh, dude! Four vault hunters! How is that like a unicorn at all, you dumbass? Ah, oh, I can't even. I can't. You talk to him. Yeah, I did. I heard them crimson raider dudes talk about it. Moron. Like a unicorn. Or as I like to call it, plan turn this city into a floating ass fortress of airborne awesomeness. Ha <laughs> ha. I got some fuel cells around here. I'm just, I'm just shooting him in the face and throwing my guns at him. Oh, he gave us some iridium. Yeah, but then we gotta pick up the fuel cells and go do science. The other one is down here. Well, let's head right. 
God, let's roll. I'll buy the last power cell from Earl. Okay. Bandits of Sanctuary. I hear a new vault hunter has arrived in your city, so just turn him into me and you'll be rewarded. Don't worry, nobody's gonna turn you in. You're our only hope of stopping Jack. Can I turn us in? Like literally, I'll turn myself in, Krieg will kill me, and then like starve himself to death and we'll respawn outside of the uh prison. Problem solved. Oh. So you do want to buy something, but we got the third fuel cell, guys. Yeah. More shotguns. I bought a backpack expansion just so I could carry more stuff. So I could sell more stuff, so. Alright, the fuel cells are in. Wait, are these the fruits of your loins, Krieg? Alright, so I'll stare at those. <laughs> Damn. Well, now we really gotta find Rowan. You know what? Maybe get to Rowan's place. I they want to trade. Left a message there for you. Hmm? Yeah, I don't want to trade. Says you want to trade. Sorry. I didn't mean to. Vault Hunter, get it! Rowan left a message for you. Yep, so, whew. we got the SDU weapon equip slot. Soldier, you this, I'm in trouble. Right now, you're the only thing standing between this city, hell, the whole planet, and Handsome Jack's army. I left info about my whereabouts. Oh, that's for a side quest that we got to do. Store anything you need. Good luck. Grab all the bullets out of these washing machines. Got to keep my murder biscuits clean. We can't get in there yet. I don't know how to get in there, but I never actually, I've never actually bothered to get in there. Yeah, some iridium. Okay. Firehawk, you mean the mass murderer and bounty hunter? Oh crap! If the Firehawk's got him, Rowan's in deep. You gotta get free. Oh, we know he's in deep. You get, you get what I mean there, Dad? Nah. Seriously? You know what I mean. Do I? Oh god, this is so much shit popping off at once. Just. All kinds of shit procking. Well, we need to um go back and shoot these guns at people to test them just to get them out of our inventory. Yeah, yeah, we will just in a second. Just gotta introduce Dr. Zed. I thought it was Dr. Ned. Uh, no, it, it's Zed right now. Ned is when he need, Ned is when he needs to go on the run to do zombie stuff. Oh yeah, that's right. Which I look forward to doing. Uh so that is Rock, paper, genocide, fire weapons. Just below his sternum, but be careful. We don't want to nick the coronary artery. Oh yeah, we get to perform surgery. Yep, yeah, but first let's go shoot guns. He doesn't even give us guns, jerk. No, he did. No, no, no. I mean like freebies for once we're done. Oh. Yeah, he's got a business to run. He could give us freebies. 
affect it now. Burn that imperialist bastard like a skag steak. <laughs> These Hyperion fascists. Take that, Jack lover. Yeah, a few good hits from a shock weapon. Hmm, now what the armored targets like these damned Hyperion robots. Now let's try up. Now that he's slagged, he should be easy enough to finish off. Switch to another weapon and hit him again. To do full damage, you'll want to switch to another weapon once your enemy has been slagged. Are you just shooting him with the slag gun? Uh, well, yeah, he, he slagged before I could switch over to a different gun. You can hear this. If you want to purchase any elemental weapons like these, you could always buy some from your friendly neighborhood arms dealer. The Hyperion army is coming to wipe it out. If you want to survive and you get a gun, you come to Sanctuary and you join the Crimson Raiders. Farewell, man. Okay. I want to get into his vault. Uh, so, pump this into fire. So then, what do you want to do next? You got Claptrap well, Secret Stash. Do no harm. I'm going to pick up this passable sniper rifle because I need a sniper rifle for my third slot. Okay. But otherwise, it's up to you. Uh, let's... Ooh, let's go perform surgery. Okay. That's a quick one. Yes, let's. Yeah, I love the sanctuary nights. The sky is so brilliant like blood. Yeah. That was almost poetic. Oh my god, I just realized how lazy the name Dr. Ned is. Wait, seriously? He just turns one letter around. Yeah, I know that. That's the joke. Oh, I'm so mad at myself. He doesn't even like, <coughs> like pull a new letter out of the alphabet. He just turns one. Yeah. As I've said, Roland, now that Jack has the vault key, it is only a matter of time until he opens the vault. Also, I require a new ventilator. This lab smells of bacon. Bacon for sycophants and products of incest. Hey. Go to hell. Bacon is one of the most divine cre creations man has ever forged. Alrighty then, I guess. This one's in now Sanctuary. For us. Let's just do the Claptrap one, it's in Sanctuary. Well, dude, Dr. Ned, Dr. Zed's got another quest for us, so, like... <clears throat> yeah, we'll pick that up in a second. Or you can pick it up, I don't know. Alright. If you don't mind, I'll yeah, go ahead. grab it then. You know what can make a bullet hole that you help me reach sanctuary, Lincoln, and for that you deserve a reward. I have a secret stash hidden very, very far away from where I currently am. In order to find it, you have to perform a series of devious challenges. First, collect a few brown rocks for me. Then defeat a badass gang. Then pilfer the lost staff of Mount Schuler. Then. You shall bring me the head of the destroyer of worlds! And then you shall dance for my enjoyment! <laughs> What's that punching? There's a dash. Oh, there it is. Over here. So it's nothing? Uh, you can put stuff there for your other characters. Ah. Uh, ugh. Yeah. At least we got experience. Yeah, so what do you want to do now? Uh, Wait. let me see what quests we've got. We've got Assassinate the Assassins, the Name Game, Medical Mystery, and Hunt the Firehawk. Uh, well, we've got a pistol, a shotgun, an assault rifle, and a sniper rifle. Assassinate the assassins. 
Alrighty. Or we could go kill some bully monks. Uh, we'll do that um, eventually. But for now, uh, we will be calling there for, for this episode. So be sure to join us next time for the murder spree. Yay, murder spree! Yeah. Until then, though, I'm dead. And I'm not looking forward to it because I can't use Death Trap. We'll see you guys next time. Goodbye, have a wonderful time. Excuse me while I whip this out. <laughs>